What's up you guys, Wolverine for Aerosol Wolverines and today I'm going to show you my Masada or my support Masada all the upgrades I've done to it uh, the upgrades I've done from day one that I've got it to the current so whenever I first got it I went ahead and put a 9.6 volt in there I had an 8.4 and that's just what came with it so I needed something that was bigger then I bought some I bought a rail for the bottom so I can mount some other accessories like some an angled foregrip and a foregrip bipod and then I bought some XTMs because I really like the way the XTMs are if you see my G&G &G, upgraded G&G &G video I have some XTMs on my G&G &G. I really like them just like the whole pattern um, down here I have just some Ruger clips I bought those whenever I had the G&G &G too uh, this I bought this before the XTMs it's a QD sling mount point that goes on your rails and then I have a sling attachment for my one point sling and it came with these flip up sights and then my most recent thing is a 5000 round auto winding echo one drum mag now the reason I don't have an unboxing of this or a video of it because whenever I had first gotten it it didn't uh, fit because a Masada is different it still takes an M4 mag but um, sometimes you can't fit like drum mags in here so let me show you what I actually I had to do and so uh, I had the little button control on here so every time I push that button it's gonna wind what I actually did is I had to cut this part out in order for it to fit and the reason is because it has this right here uh, this right there and that makes it like bulge out so you know, it's no big deal it took about maybe uh, 10 minutes, 10-15 minutes to fix, and then I was all good. I really like this drum mag so far. So every time you push the button, it's gonna wind. Uh, really nice, 5,000 rounds. I've not done anything on the insides. I hope to do maybe something in the future, and maybe I think I'm gonna add a, a mock suppressor on the end. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I might make a review on the Echo 1 drum mag, might not. But, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. We'll see you guys next time.